Hello guys, it's Mungai Eve na niko na mwanangu wa nguvu presenter Ali. We are here by the way tuko wengi wengine wako nyuma tumekuja hapa kum support cuz we have good news to all of you. By the way, congratulations to you. Thank you very hey, much. Eh, jana leo. We unataka kututa Day 1 and day 2. <laughs> anyway, tuko mahali hapa. Mm -hmm. Nataka mwana tuelezee tuko wapi. Mm -hmm. Then we go inside we get to see what exactly iko hapa. Yeah, uh tuko sema mbona inaitwa numeral mm -hmm. IOT. Uh, IOT basically means Internet of Things. Uh, uh, the CEO atakuwa na explain more kuhusu IOT, but it's actually a tech firm mm -hmm. uh, ambao wana produce, you know, stuff from scratch, you know, from an idea to bringing an idea to life. Mm -hmm. And I've actually been, you know, uh, selected as the brand ambassador of products as well. Mm -hmm. So we'll actually in uh, introduce the CEO Munyewe, then he'll take us through do a numeral IOT ni wapi na wanadel na nini exactly and the type of products ambazonita kuana represent here. Mm -hmm. yeah. Wow, congratulations once more. Thank you very much. Ah, I'm really happy for you. Yani mwana ame grow acha tu. Ah, na mshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu. Afia na washukuru mashabiki you know for the love, for sure. the support ambao wanaonyesha. Bibi kwa sababu bila wao hatuwezi mm -hmm. tukafika sehemu ambazo tumefika. Yeah. Wow. So guys, we want to go inside. We we get to see what exactly that is there. But before that, uh, I want to introduce the CEO kuja tuambie mawili matatu then we get inside by the i'm very impressed yani kuna kuanga na vitu mob sana made in kenya and probably yeah. people out here they don't no, no. know yeah, yeah. yeah so the ceo welcome kuja tuambie mawili matatu <laughs> hi hi mambo poa sana tunakuita nani morris mimi naitwa morris mbetsa mm -hmm. yes betsa betsa <laughs> <laughs> okay, Maurice, yes. tell us more about uh, Numeral IoT. So Numeral IoT is a, it's a Kenyan company fully owned and um, we design and manufacture electronics. Mm -hmm. Na history ya Numeral tumetoka mbali sana. Personally, I've been designing electronics since nikiwa mdogo. Mm -hmm. Na kumeko na a lot of challenges because um, uh, if let's say ukona idea yako saizi, mm -hmm. uh, unataka kutengeneza your own power bank, how do you go about it? There's no like clear way where utasema this is how I'm supposed to do for me to build my own power bank. Mm -hmm. So nilikuwa on the same uh, spot because nilikuwa innovative. I ni may invent so many things. Back, if you check online, they invented their first passenger drone mm -hmm. like four years ago. Mm -hmm. I invented the first device that you can control your car from your phone, Kuzima, Kuwasha, in 2008. Mm -hmm. But back then I never had a facility whereby I can be able to produce. Mm -hmm. So there were a lot of challenges, but I thank God like three years ago, Nika, Nika, Nika Anza, Numeral. So this is where we produce all uh, all our devices. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Okay. What are some of the devices that you may produce already? So we are the number one manufacturer of speed limiters for NTSA. Mm -hmm. We are producing car tracking devices. We are producing smart home devices. We've just uh, launched our smart power meter. We have a token size of So we have a newer uh, meter, a full IoT meter, whereby when you buy the token, it will go direct to the meter. So that's one of the products that we've just started. We manufacture uh, uh, CPE devices. CPE is um, a camera router, yeah, internet. So routers are internet, smart home, uh, smart water meter, smart gas meter. Uh, we also did some uh, time to do speakers, to do thermometers. So, Basically, those are the products that, uh, that we have. But uh, we also work with other uh, people who want to create their own products. So if you think about it, I'll make it happen. Mm -hmm. So that's basically what Numeral is about. Wow. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, <laughs> no, no. Uh, I, uh, I'm really I'm, I'm happy you know, to be part and parcel of Numeral IoT. Uh, because uh, growing up, I was like, 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 I content creation. Mm -hmm. okay, <laughs> the other side. Yeah, yeah. Uh, anyway, I want us to get inside yeah, yeah. to on a hot exactly. You know, you are going to place in a tenge ni zangu speakers. You need ni anashanga. Then you kuna kaje. So I want us to go inside. I take you through, guys, so that we can get to understand what exactly tuna tuna pata to king figure kwa place kama is. Ndio. Yes, Santi Santi. And you see also a lot of the people who work here ni between. 20 to 30 years. Mm -hmm. Where to wengine, many of them actually have a degrees. Wengine ni drop out, uh, the school drop out. And I would say 98 uh, percent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, anybody who works here never came here with papers. Mm -hmm. Si jawai onata pepa ya mtu moja. Mm -hmm. Yeah, including me, PSC. But how did they secure <laughs> the job? <laughs> okay, tunangalia interest. As long as you have interest, mm -hmm. uta learn. Mm -hmm. 
na tunapatia watu chance like if you come here you are a young person you want to create devices we'll give you time mm -hmm. you come you learn after 2 3 months if you okay tunaweza kupatia job mm -hmm. still bado kama unataka kuendelea ku learn utalana na ukikuwa na idea yako pia that it's good you can we can as well support you mm -hmm. to put it to production so many of the people that are working here actually have uh, many of them ni watu wamemaliza form 4 watu assembling wengi ni class 8 mm -hmm. na hata class 8 atujiona document zao ni watu wenye when we were setting up this place walikuwa wengine wana wataka tu biashara kuja kukuosha wanaosha nguo so we took them we trained them and one of the things that we also want to showcase is whereby kila mtu kwa dunia you can be able to do something kwa maisha yako all you need is a chance so and we've proven that mtu mwenye hana any paper ya shule here they are manufacturing electronics and the, the vision that we have is to have such facilities across uh, different counties, counties in Kenya and also across Africa so that we can be able to create employment. This microphone many of the cameras that you guys are using, chargers, this is employment that ulitumana pesa ikakuja. Now we want to make sure that in the next like five years all these devices tunazi produce up and we create employment to other people, uh, young people in your wenzetu, Africa wenzetu. Okay. Yeah. So uh, another question, when you manufacture the product do you sell to different companies so that they can sell to individuals Ama, how does it work so we have uh, we have products that we like customer comes direct to us but also we have partnership with other companies for example like in kenya soon we'll be launching one of the biggest partnership that we've had with one of the biggest telcos that um, that uh, that we is in the pipeline we have a we have a telco that we've partnered in tanzania in Etwatigo. we are launching uh, three products in tanzania we have a telco we've partnered in mozambique we are moving to Egypt, we are moving to, uh, to Ghana, Ivory Coast, uh, Uganda. So we are working with the utility companies, we are working with telcos, we are working also with, the, with companies and then we, we as well work with like uh, individuals. So to a product yenye mtu kawaida boda boda anaweza kununua, to a product yenye let's say um, telco anaweza kununua kutoka kwetu, to a product let's say Kenya Power anaweza kununua kutoka kwetu. Yeah, so we have different different kind of products and we also produce products that if you see them in the market need competitors but we produce for them. So it, kona lese uko na idea yako hivi ya nini ungependa kukuwa nayo hivi mimi eh mimi yes simu haichajiwi okay sawa <laughs> <laughs> so simu ya hivi ambayo haichajiwi we, we can build it for you we use it kwa market with your own brand kila kitu ni yako but sisi we are behind the technology and we are behind the the production so we chini ya maji tunakusupport kuleta hiyo vision yako to reality yeah, yeah. Wow, thank you so much, Maurice. Let's get inside to an Indani Kukaji. So, welcome to Numeral IoT. So, this is the reception. Oh, yeah. wow. Yeah. These are the people that inspired me when I, when I started. I used to watch a lot of uh, tech documentaries, and I always wanted to be like them. I always look at how Steve Jobs alianzisha iPhone, paka mali penye kafika. This guy, Dr. Robert Noyce, is behind um, Intel, Silicon Valley. So Silicon Valley is uh, considered kama father of Silicon Valley. Mm -hmm. This is, of course, Elon Musk. So these are the people that each time if I walk, kama niko na challenge yoyote, niko na, because pressure ziko kila mahali. So nikipita hapa, nikiwangalia, wananipatia, like courage to keep on, keep on going. Uh, Bill Gates, pako hapo, kuna wengine wakuju. Yes, yeah, yeah. so karibuni. So this way. So I'll give you a, a quick tour. So, so on the other side we have R&D. So that's where we design all the products. So once the design is done, prototype is done, to make sure test killer cuticle sour. So we bring in the raw material. Actually today, these are some of the raw material we just received. Eh? So this is how we received all our raw material. So some people say they manufacture electronics in Africa, but they actually don't manufacture, they assemble. So assembling means that you bring the motherboard, you just put it in the casing, then you just put in the screws. But for us, we do manufacturing right from the motherboard. So this is how we receive our components. So this is a consignment that has just been received today. So they, they are checking all the components, sorting it out. So these, all the components come in form of reels. So these are called reels. So uh, then, ukiangali moja, maybe kona like 5,000 components inside here. So actually, this sort uh, in this side. Eh? So this is called an SMT. So that's where we manufacture the actual mother. So these are, these are called feeders. So feeders, that's where you, you arrange all the components. The first step is from this machine. So this, 
it's, um, it's, 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 it's called automatic solder paste machine. So this is where you put solder paste on your motherboard. So usually, uh, let me just get wow, let me, let motherboard more job. Yeah, so. so this is how the motherboard looks. So these are tracks. So easy from the R&D. So wana uh, uh, all this design. So these are the connection to each of the components. So before you put into production, lazima weke solder. So this machine is the one that puts solder on the board. So this is called an automatic loader. In a temporarily, once that machine is done, in a push, in a ingia, in a weka components. So this is the heart of the whole operation. So all the components in ingia kwa, in a kuja apa, on a zirange apa. So inside, on your head when you naenda. So you in a kuja inside, in a pick components, alafu in a place kwa board. In a pick components, in a place kwa board. Ikisha maliza, the board in a toka, in a toka this side. So, so in a toka this side in a kuwa, in a kuwa ivo. Kutoka apu in iko ivo without components, ikitoka uki kona. You're gonna components. Then from here, in a kuja apa. So this is an oven. So e oven, it a heat. If you talk at the other side, in a kuta, the components now are now permanently on the on the board as you as you talk up. Then if you talk at the other side, in a kuja, zinenda sasa kwa kwa assembling. So like from that, once you move on, so if you figure muisho in a kuwa, all the components is kwa uh, the processor, everything is kwa board. So the other side is an assembling. So we have people that will be able to check, test, put in the software. And then put it in the casing, and then packaging. Alafu ina kuwa sasa. Yeah. Wow, that's so amazing. Can you Maybe you can go the other side. So I can show you. Yeah. So this is the process of all the products. Let's say any tracking device, power meter, mobile phone charger, mm -hmm. the same process. This side the assembly. Yeah? So that's where we do the assembling. The other side. We do, let's say, if there are, there are any repairs. So these are some of the products that are that that the So I'll just quickly just show you some of the products that, uh, that we have. So right from here, so these are these are smart uh, smart water meter. So nona meter ya maji saizi. Every month somebody has to come to your house and read the meter. So with this one, each day it has to be reading once. If at end of the month you don't need to send anybody already kona. So this we partner with the. Uh, water companies to uh, for them to like utilize the technology. So they either buy from us, or we give them as a service. Whereby we install the meter for free, but then okay, lipa maji, we get a percentage out of that to recover the cost of uh, of um, of the hardware. Then uh, so these are these are th so these we use to man we've stopped the production of these. So it's called nafanya temia temia COVID. Uh, remember temia COVID biashara mingi zilienda yat. So kila mali ukona require kuwa na thermometer. So this is. Uh, this we did uh, your time, uh, time of COVID, and then we have a speed governor. So this this is um, is the product that I would say. Ukiwangalia ata mukito kapa, mukienda kutoka barabara, angalia matatu mingi nyuma utapata stika ya simba. So this is our product. Any car that you see kona simba, this is our product. So this is a speed governor. So this is mandatory. Any commercial vehicle must have this device. The way they complete a inspection in TSA. So this we've been producing this for the last two years and actually we have a newer version that we are launching next month that will include Wi-Fi and it's cheaper than whatever is in the market but will include Wi-Fi and cameras so that when Yamatatu can be able to like see in real time what's going on in their, uh, in their vehicles. So this we've been producing for the last like two years and then uh, so this, this is a smart home device. So with this we have a partnership in Tanzania that we are launching uh, next month. I think tulikuwa na wewe ali in Tanzania. So with this, it's a smart home device whereby una connect TV yako, hapo TV yako inakuwa smart. So TV yako inakuwa na Google, Netflix, you can browse the internet. It comes with inbuilt 4G. Then it's also a smart home. Let's say uh, from your phone, you can check the level of water in your tank. You can decide to turn on your power, your water pump, kuzima water pump, turn on security lights, and many other functions that is inbuilt with, uh, with this. So this already we have a big partnership that we are launching this in next month in Tanzania with one of the biggest uh, uh, telcos. Mm -hmm. Then um, this is this is the power meter. So I'll show you a demo of uh, of uh, of uh, of this on on uh, on the other side. Mm -hmm. And then this is the tracking device. So these are um, these are very low cost tracking device for motorbikes and cars. So trackers are market, but they are very expensive, and also um, the functions are not tailor made for 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 us. The general is a tracking device that can be sold in China, in India, but this we've built it with functions that specifically to address uh, our market. And we will uh, soon introduce this to the market as low as 3,000 shillings. So I think uh, Ali will do a, a video with more details about um, this tracking device. But this functions that this specific one has that the rest they don't have. Okay, so number one, 
I'll show you something I saw. I'll quickly show you. So this, this is an accessory for this. So you can work on a car, you can work on a car, you can OBD. Iko pale chini ya diagnostics. So ukiweka hii na ukiweka hii tracker. So this will pick all the, uh, will connect to your computer, I mean uh, to your car ECU. Itume data kwa hii na ikulete kwa simu. So from your phone, every time you, somebody starts your car, you can be able to check your engine temperature, RPM, coolant temperature. Ukikuwa nataya check engine, before you take your car to the mechanic, from your phone you can be able to know what's wrong with your car. You can as well be able to clear it. So this is something that like, right now ukikuwa na shida ya gari yako lazima uende kwa mechanic unalipia diagnostics juu 2023 so with this like every time the device makes sure that your vehicle health is okay and gives you real time information on on your phone you can be able to lock your doors and lock your door ukataka kutumana mtu kwa gari yako you don't need to give them the key unaambia wewe enda ukifika unamfungulia from your phone they'll be able to open if they start the, your car without your consent you get a notification from your phone akisema anaenda you get the location of your car in real time Okay, umepiana gari your friend unajua rafiki yako anapenda kuendesha gari mbio unajua utapata amani ukutuo na wasiwasi instead of kukua na wasiwasi take your phone set the maximum speed mweke 50 ikifika saa 6 sasa unajua ameenda out na ni mlevi mweke 30 atakuja na speed 30 paka so that what this device be able to if one of the greatest difference is the fact that this is the only one ambayo iko locally manufactured mm-hmm. yeah uh, yeah true <laughs> So that's 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 the board. Eh? That's the board and 100% done here and assembled by. Uh, we also have, uh, we also have the hewa. Yes, so we have this so this we started the production time ya time ya covid. Mm-hmm. So time ya covid wasanii walikuwa hawa perform. So actually the reason why we did this was to be able to to like support them because they never used to perform. So we said why why don't uh, don't we like build a product that can be able to sell but we tie it na na wasanii that we 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 are able to to support them so we the first production tulifanya hiyo uh, time ya covid but then we had stopped but then a lot of people actually we had visitors from the US last week na venye walienda wakaenda na sample size wana to push that we are we are supposed to send some export to the US so it's one of the product that uh, we now want to bring back to the market because of the feedback tupatie kila mtu sample you as well test and give us feedback yes yeah thank you so those are some of the products that you have so i can i'll quickly show you the, the demo for the power meters but you can okay now we tumewafundisha hapa mhm hawa tumewafundisha like 100% hawajakuja na any document ya shule hata mm-hmm. sijui wamesoma wapi mm-hmm. but when we met walikuwa na hiyo passion they are willing to learn now angali i'm so proud of her from where she ametoka mpaka sasa hizi ana 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 not components zenye zimeingia na zinaenda kwa which product mm-hmm. which i'm sure like, like a year ago hakukuwa najua capacity inakaja ma resistor inakaja but like just looking at them mm-hmm. what they are doing and the impact that wanafanya with the products that we're pushing out like when i patia you drive you keep on keep on moving okay are you still looking after maybe kuleta watu wengine wa train no yes, more is maybe na kiambia watu aje huko watu wanakuja no papers unajua maybe mtu anaweza watch aulize if mbona huko tuulize kama tunaweza kama eh by the way tuko na tuko na program which nitawaita uh, in the next like a week or two tuna launch ya specifically training because for us we are the only local manufacturers for electronics we want kukuena zingine 10 or 20 so that we can create uh, an impact because at the end of the day it's not just me making money but nataka to create your impact so we want to also like open up the knowledge to other young people that were creative and they want to know how they be able to convert their ideas into products so tutawaita maybe the next like a week or so we'll be ready to launch the, the program i'll show tutaambia watu how to register and then tutakuwa tuna tunafundisha on how to be able to, to design and build and manufacture package market products mm-hmm. wow so i'll quickly show you uh, ukiangalia okay, imeandika no credit that means the meter has no units sawa so now the idea is you have a meet, you have a you have a meter in your house umesafiri uh, ukiweka like uki, ukununua token you have to physically go to the house na weke the token so there's a there's a case one of my, my a guy sent me an email akasema kuna 
ako na nani wa kumuangalia mtoto. The nani is so good to take care of the kid, lakini haja soma. So huyu akisafiri, akinunua token, lazima atafute mtu mwingine mwenye amesoma, aende kwa nyumba yake ndio amweke token. So nasema I cannot fire the nani because haja soma because it, the, she takes good care of the baby. So if there is a way that I can be able to like do a remote top up that will really So there's a lot of challenges uh, with the, the, the current technology ya meters. So now with this, no credit. So now I'll show you, without a keypad, you can be able to do a top-up. So let's do a top-up for, let's say, 50 units. Uh, so let's quickly do 50 units. Right. So do a recharge. So just watch. There you have 50. Mm -hmm. Then again, let's, for, uh, for example, let's say, um, I'm not in my house. Nataka nataka ni zime steam sitaki steam yangu itumike kama nataka kuwasha still remotely you can be able to turn on your power from your phone not let's say a laptop eh you can use kuwasha steam yako mali popote penye ukikuwa you can as well try with your phone then you can turn it off then let's say hapa uko na si tuko na 50 units na let's say madeo shagu hana units na hauna pesa so tuchukue hapa tuchukue 10 So you can remove 10 units, just watch here. So now 50, no, you 40. So you've taken 10, you can send the 10 to, to, another, yeah, to another meter. And then of course we also have a lot of tools that we give utility companies to be able to see in case somebody amefanya tampering na iyo meter, let's say I may bypass. Uh, you can be able to analyze wewe kama mtumiaji unaweza kuangalia kwa simu yako ujue what is on in your house how much are you ume consume leo which hour you are using more power saa ngapi uh, i mean uh, which day of the week unatumia power mingi you can set threshold let's say unataka in a month nataka nitumie stima ya 1000 ukiset ina ina distribute so itakuwa inakuambia let's say leo umepitisha Cash, uh, so make sure kesho umeupunguze so inakusaidia ku meet your energy targets. So that's one of the hottest products that we have right now. Now we have inquiries over 15 countries now. We are actually moving very soon to um, to Nanda Egypt, Ivory Coast, Ghana, Senegal, uh, Uganda, Rwanda. So there are like many African countries that are already we we in discussion. Tanzania we've already done pilot and uh, soon we'll, uh, we'll we'll be launching this product in uh, in Tanzania. So yeah. Okay. Oh, we are done. Yes. yes so uh -huh. yes. So that is it about the tour. Yes. Wow. That's so amazing. But I'd like to know uh, Kenyans wamechukulia hiki tuaje. Is it accepted ama still watu hawajaelewa about things being manufactured uh, locally? So surprisingly the reception has been so good. So so good and uh, I would say actually people prefer the products that have made here than even the products that, uh, that have been imported because if they have any issues we are able to quickly act on them if there is specific customization that they want let's say kuna, kuna mali nataka changes actually our track kuna menu paka ya kiswahili bala wandike stop kwa unazandika zima so hata kama mtu mwenye, mwenye especially in Tanzania unajua Tanzania hata mtu like, uki, uki, like unajua kuna hiyo kulikuwa na hiyo issue ya language barrier so we were, we were able to like customize to their local uh, local language so same way in Kenya and all our devices kuna kitu inaitwa uh, OTA so we can be able to upgrade the software over the air so tukisha tukisha deploy the product na kuna specific uh, I would say uh, need that the customer want we are able uh, once we are able to customize na na tuna tuna, tuna. so any customer kuna hiyo flexibility that they can walk to numeral and tell us this is how i want my product uh, to be mm -hmm. yeah on my left, I can see something right here. Probably yes. could be interesting <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> for the viewers to see it. Yes. What, what is it exactly? So this, uh, it is a passenger drone. Eh? Uh -huh. So it will find, actually we, 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 we built this before we had this facility. Mm -hmm. So it will find, um, like four years ago. Mm -hmm. So we wanted to prove, because you see in Dubai, in the US, unasikia kutakuwa na drones zinabeba watu. But it's a new technology. So when we saw that like four or five years ago, to go to Nawauliza, what are the plans for Africa? When, when are, will these drones be seen in Africa? But akukwa na jibu. So we said because see, see, barabara zetu ndi ombaya. See, technology ntakana yanze uku. But because they don't care about us, it's us to care about our own problems. Start thinking about how we are, we are going to use technology and solve our own problems. So we designed this. Na to share concept whereby we can actually build such high technological uh, uh, demanding uh, technologies. Na to prove kama inafanya. So hii tulifanya, tumenda kajado, tulifly kajado several times. 
and uh, kutoka hapo then uh, to, to, tumekuwa tukiongea na KCA for so long to be able to see how we can be able to like actually like take this to the next level but then same time numeral came so demanding all these products because na tuitaji and then this is a capital intensive because there's a lot of security navigation system that we have to build power propulsion system propeller like there's a lot that um in Etajika. but of now the last like two years we have a team specifically designing the newer version of this ukiangalia body tulifanya na fiberglass this is a almost 80 kg we have a newer body that we've designed which is around 20 kg so to me to me reduce the weight of the body we have newer motors i'll show you up there we have newer motor kama hii motor moja ilikuwa inabeba inaweza kubeba 4 kg i mean 40 kg we have a newer motor that can carry 80 kg so the motor is advanced now the body is better propulsion system is better battery technology is improved so in the next like a month or two nitawaita tu ndio mali tuka fly yeah yeah, yeah. wow Ali, yes. ah, what are some of the products? To mention so many products, what are some of the products in your way Utakwa Uki push out there? Uh, personally, I'll be pushing uh, a few products. Uh, the first product, Sambayo Itakwa Nihewa, of course, Unajua, uh, my, most of the people who are in Fortilia, they're young, most of the people who are in Fortilia, who are in Kujibamba, and Hewa is one of them, which is a wireless Bluetooth speaker. There's also the car tracker. Uh, plus the e meter, e meter ya, the smart meter, and also the, the there's a car tracker, meter, uh, hewa, and the speed governor. Those are the products, the main products. Ambazo ntakuwa na skuma kwa sasa. But uh, there are other products ambazo sita kubaliwa kusema ambazo zina in the future. Na badu, uh, mimi ndo ntakuwa na skuma. Yeah. Thank you so much. We really appreciate, guys. This, uh, that is it about the tour. We also have having another video to watch. Kifanya maybe atatuelezea mo una jo una jo kuna kile kwa udaku ka anepewa ngapi una jo. We'll be having that discussion in another video. But in the meantime, make sure you watch this tour uh, and subscribe. We meet in the next one.